what I'm going to show you today uh, is a uh, just a demonstration playing the game uh, Marty's Nightmare for the Color Computer 3. Uh, in 1990, as the Color Computer was uh, no longer being made and as the uh, market was going down, uh, Steve Bork, who wrote a lot of the games over the years for the Color Computer, uh, wanted to test the market to see if there was still the market to support a game, uh, support the cost of, of developing a game, and so he developed uh, a game called Marty's Nightmare. Uh, it was a tribute to Marty Goodman uh, of some fame in the color computer world. He uh, wrote quite a bit of articles on the uh, in Rainbow Magazine and was uh, uh, quite active on Delphi Forum and provided a lot of help to a lot of people, including myself. And so uh, Steve Bork wrote this game uh, to uh, as kind of as a tribute to him as well, uh, and distributed it at the Atlanta Cocoa Fest. Uh, initially, the only way you could get it was if you actually attended the fest. Well, I wasn't fortunate enough to be able to attend, but after the fest was over and there were some unsold copies of the game, um, one of the companies, I'm pretty certain it was Cocoa Pro, uh, made the game available. Uh, with through arrangements with Steve Bork uh, and I was able to obtain a copy. Uh, I don't know exactly how successful the game was but it wasn't as successful I don't think as Steve Bork hoped because we didn't really see any more games after this but it was a very good game and I don't think he really lost any money or not lost too much money on the development of it so now we'll uh, set up and uh, play the game some and see how that goes. Welcome to Marky's Nightmare. Get ready, player one. I've got a hardware problem. Oh, really? 